What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of TCG Card Shop Simulator. Last episode we had probably our best episode of this, honestly, yet. Um, it's, it was an epic one. We got our first ghost card, which actually I can show you guys. Here, let's go ahead and sort. We got our first ghost card here, which is worth quite a bit of money, almost $500. Excuse me, plus the 20% if we were to sell it. And we got our first basically $1,000 card here. We have an 1160 card. It is market price at 942. It was like 960 when we pulled it. So basically, um, almost a thousand dollars for that. And um, I also forgot. I just, I just realized. I ended off. The, I'm recording this right after the last episode. Um, I just realized. I forgot to show you guys the outlook or the outcome of having uh, our prices rounded here. Um, so it, our cashier is able to keep up with everything. But we had 78 people. So we increased our customer count by seven yesterday from the previous day. So that definitely makes a big difference. Having um, Having the customers not getting stuck in here basically as long with that. So that is awesome. But um, yeah, anyways, if you guys are enjoying this, be sure to drop a like in the video. Show it some love and support. And if you guys are new around here checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we are doing here. But we are going to continue on with everything here today and um, try to unlock our first legendary cards here, which we're about half of a level. Shop level away from unlocking, which I am so hyped on. I really am. So... We are just going to keep on rolling through. I'm going to readjust our pricing, make sure that everything is good to go. Obviously, things are pretty much staying about the same, but we'll just go through, make sure that we're all good with all of that, and uh, go from there. But yeah, like I said, we're just going to keep on rolling through some cards here, keep pulling some, see what we can get. Maybe we can top that, maybe with, with an actual $1,000 card, like base market price, and uh, go from there with everything. But so we got some new items unlocked as well. We got our boxes unlocked of these two, and we got our our supply of everything looking really good here. So I'm really happy with all of that, and uh, we're just gonna keep on rolling through with everything here today. Yeah, I think everything's staying basically about the same for the pricing, but that's fine. I'd rather just go through things here in the morning real quick and get things adjusted <clears throat> for us, so we are good to go with all of that. But there we go. We got all that adjusted. We have almost three thousand. Wait, oh, we sold it. We sold it. I'm very excited about that, but also a little sad. I'm not going to lie about that. That is insane. We just sold our highest value card ever in this game, including the prologue. We had like a $800 card before in the prologue. And um, that is that is that. So that is insane. That uh, we, just, we just sold it. We got at least a bunch of money out of it, though. So that is awesome. Things are looking really good for the store and everything. We've got extra, an extra surplus of supply. Our bills are paid. We are ready to just keep on going through and advancing in the store. We really are. And it is amazing. I love it. <sighs> it is so nice. I'm so tempted to sell this shelf and get down to just these shelves here for now in the store. Because we actually need to get another shelf kind... Well... We need, we need storage shelves, that's for sure, because we are full on that, which we don't have space for. Um, uh, I don't know. I think maybe we save up for the other shop here today, actually. I think we actually do that, honestly. I think we're to the point where we really need the extra space now. I think, it, I think it's time. I think we're going to work towards that here today. I really think that's what we're going to do here. I was just thinking about that. We kind of, we need some shop expansion to be able, be able to even do anything and if we can't get the shop expansion for another whole level whole level and a half here and it's going to cost us two grand for that anyway so it's like that's basically almost half the cost right there plus the time waiting just to even get that so i think we save up here today and we get our new shop along with getting the legendary cards i think that's what we do I'm still not sure. Obviously, I'm recording this, like I said, right after the last episode, so I haven't gotten your guys' feedback on the ghost card, if we keep it or if we sell it. I feel like we keep that card. I, I don't think it's worth the $500 to sell it. I think we just keep it and let's savor it. We'll keep... That will be one of our sh one of our cards for our own personal card shelf that we'll get here. Actually, maybe we'll, maybe we'll get that here today. I don't know. I can't remember how much it is. We'll have to take a look at that again and see. But I think that's what we save up for is I kind of wish I hadn't paid the bills now because that was an extra 450, 500 bucks or so out of our pocket that we could have had to put towards the store with that. Obviously, I know we need like two grand to unlock. Okay, there we go. It's another pretty good card. We need like two grand to unlock the other cards, the legendary cards, which we definitely want to do here today. But um, yeah, I don't know. I don't really know where we go with this, whether we get the shop or we get, um, well, I mean, we could put, pro potentially do both. I don't know. We're going to try and do both if we can. We will see. 
with all of this. But let's uh, just keep on pulling cards. We're going to get them out on the shelves right away to be able to sell and go from there with things. 13 bucks for that. Okay. There is all of that. Let's just, again, keep our shelves nice and stocked up with everything here. Plus 20% in round. Uh, we actually need some green cards, green box cards out here. Okay. Uh, we just got an achievement for cleaned 500 smelly customers. <laughs> that was not an achievement I was expecting to begin this game before starting to play this, but we got it nonetheless. <laughs> but anyways, okay. A small personal shelf. Isn't small card display card dis I'm assuming that this holds the cards, right? Individual cards for 150 bucks. But but I don't see also the um I feel like that's gotta be that, right? Um shelf to store your personal items, store up to three types. Okay, I don't think that actually is. Put your... Oh, okay. This is what we need right here. Put our card collection on the shelf for display. The shelf has eight card slots. So yeah, we need this one right here for 400 bucks. I almost, I don't want to spend the money on it, but at the same time, I do. I kind of want to put that card out there just for to have the looks of it. Let's start... You know what? Let's do it. Let's let's purchase it. Let's start building up that display. I know it's money we don't need to spend. It's just kind of a flashy thing right now. We really don't have the space to do it. Oh, we can't. Oh, I thought we could put that right over there. Oh, that's actually really unfortunate. I thought we could. Can we? <laughs> Okay, I have an idea here. Well, like look at how, look at the floor space here. We just do not have the space to even do anything right now. So let's just place this right here. I guess we are going to do our ghost card out here. There we go. First card on display right there for us in our case. I love it. That is so awesome. I think it's well worth it for us. I know it sucks to spend the money. We really don't need to right now, but that, that was a big moment for us to unlock our first ghost card. And that's one of the reasons I don't want to sell it. I think uh, it's going to be really cool to have on display and I want to kind of cherish it and not just sell it like it's worthless to us <laughs> for all of that. We're going to, we'll be, we'll have enough time to make enough money here to be able to unlock what we need to here today. So I think we'll be, we'll be plenty fine. Let's just go ahead and, um, yeah, we need to get some stuff ordered on up here, probably. Oh, we're missing a uh, a can there. We got to get that taken care of here too. There we go. Got a fresh new can in there. Let's get some lights turned on here. Get this place nice and bright. It's getting a little dark. Okay, seven dollars for that. There we go. Six bucks for that. That's fine. All right, I think we do another um, another poll, another set of polls here, because we gotta again keep on getting some XP here. We are about three thousand XP away, so it's gonna take a little bit to get that. Um, so fingers crossed we can get that here today. I don't see how we don't, but uh, we're just gonna keep working towards saving up some money so we can get our um, our second room here, our second shop. That is gonna be a big help for us, honestly. I don't know. I've seen some comments to separate that as our play game area, and I've seen some comments to separate that as our store area. So I don't know how we want to lay that out yet uh, with all of that. But we're gonna work. Yeah, I mean, we got forty-two hundred bucks. We're eight hundred less than eight hundred dollars away right now. There's no reason that we don't just save up right away and just do it. We're waiting on the um, the shop level anyway, so I think it's a perfect time to do that for us, and that's gonna help us out dramatically. With that, the only thing I just thought of is we are not going to have the sprayer, the scent sprayer in there. So it's going to cause more issues with that. So we're going to have to get a couple more of those, which is going to be another $3,000. <laughs> but it'll be worth it. I keep telling myself that, but I don't know if it will be or not. <laughs> we're going to do our best. 
try to save up here as much as we can. But we're really starting to make some good money here, so it shouldn't be too bad to save that up if we need to. Because obviously that should open up another door for us, um, which will be really nice. But yeah, it's going to be a little... Oh yeah, we definitely need... Gotta, again, keep up with our card boxes and everything before we can do anything. We need to make sure we have supplies to be able to uh, keep up in the store. So obviously with no supplies, we don't make money. Okay. But yeah, also if we... That's right, I just thought about that. If we do turn our shop area over to there, like the actual like shopping like cards area, then we can put our storage area over there too and just have this as the whole game area. So I think that actually kind of does work out because we can get even more tables in here then and really open this place up. I don't know. We can obviously rearrange things too. We don't need to leave it, I guess, um, crammed in and everything. So I don't know. We will see. But in the meantime here, let's get uh, some more car rip through some more packs. So why not? There is a... I mean, obviously that one card alone paid for all of our pack openings that we've done for the longest time right there. Plus, then obviously we have all the other cards on top of that that we've gotten. So we are way in the green on that. And all the pack openings, so it is well worth it for us uh, to be doing all that. But, anyways, let's see here. What do we got going on? I cannot believe, though, in the last episode we got our first ghost card and our first almost $1,000 card right there, which we'll see what these legendary cards bring us. We're going to do a bunch of openings here today on that, so be sure to stick around for that, because I don't see how we don't get to shop level 20 and get that unlocked here for us. Um, I feel like we have a, a little bit of a lull right now. We're not making much money. But that's all right. We're just going to keep on rolling. There's a little bit of, little bit, little chunk of change there. Okay. Come on, something good. Well, I guess that was already that. Um, we got 4600 bucks though. Looking pretty good. Our supplies looking amazing. That's where I feel comfortable to do this because our supply is good enough to keep up with what we need for all of this anyway. So pretty much. And if we need to order something here and there, it's not that big a deal for all of that. Um, yeah, we basically need to restock up on like everything here. Okay, we got 40, we're, we're about 250 bucks away only from that, which is just epic, it really is. Um, green we're good on, yellow we need a few of, blue we're good on. Um, we need a few of these. I feel like we're not selling like any of these, but that's fine. Um, these we're still good on, actually, we just went through those. We need just one of that, we need a couple of these. We have 4,900 bucks. You're so close. To unlocking the 5k of the new um, new shop space. So like I said, we are just we are bursting at the seams right now. We just don't have the space for it. For anything at the moment. Because we need more shelving. We need more storage shelves. And it's just we don't have enough room is the uh, is the reality of it. Okay, there it is. We have 5k. That is what we needed right there. Let's um Let's go ahead and bundle up some more cards here. We need another box of these. Let's just keep on rolling here. Okay. So we already sold one of these. Jeez. Um, do we need any of these? Yeah, we do. We need one of those only. We have $5,300 already. We already made another 300 bucks. So that is nice. Um. Okay. We still have some more people in here. Let's get uh, some more cards emptied on out. 12 bucks now for those. Love to see that. See, there's definitely some stuff that's lower priced, and there's also some stuff that goes up in price because it obviously is rounding to the nearest like whole dollar. So we're we're gaining, we're winning on some things, we're also losing on something. So it's kind of I feel like it kind of evens out. But there we go. Oh, so we do I was wondering about that. So we do get more shop expansion for these. So this does go out. I was like, that is a very small space, but yeah, look at that. It'll bump all the way out to there. And same with that right there. So this is a very small space for us right now, honestly. Oh, we can? Okay. So we can have people use the main entrance, so we don't even need to... That is so awesome, man. This game is just absolutely epic. This really is. I am just absolutely in love with this game. I, I am in absolute awe over this game. Okay, so there is that. Let's get some stuff rearranged here. 
We can obviously bring these on into here, which I don't know how we want to set this up because how close can maybe do like two shelves here. I feel like it's very small right now. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, we can. Okay. That's good. I like it. And then we can do like another one. Yeah, this is a very small space at the moment, but that's fine. <laughs> it's a very crammed. I don't know. Maybe I should do that. Maybe we should just do something like this. And just use our workspa workspace actually kind of like that. I think that actually kind of works and looks decent. And then we'll place this small sh the small shelf by the door here first. Like that. And then we're just going to place these in line with this right here. I think we're going to leave the checkout in here, though, as well. Okay, sorry, sir, but we don't have anybody to uh, play with you, so you're going to have to exit the gaming area. There we go. I love that we can turn off this entrance, though. That is just such a nice, awesome, amazing feature. It really is. Okay. So there's all of that. We actually finally have space for things here. Why is that? What? Um, could someone explain that to me? Why that doesn't... Why that needs to be bumped out like that? Okay, I'm not too sure, but that's fine. Um, I don't know. Maybe we do the checkout in here, actually. Because we actually kind of have space for it over here. And could we now... Yeah, we can't tell people to use the other entrance on that one. I wonder if they can exit out of here, though. Because then there would be like a nice like revolving kind of like having to actually go around and do that. I feel like we're just like starting all over now in our old, in the old space. I do like it though. It is nice. It's also weird we don't have any lighting in here. I know we do. It's like look at how dark it is in here now, but visually we don't have any lighting. So that's a bit odd. I think we keep the individual cards out here though, still. And then our display cabinet's going to go in here. So you can just see eh, what we have. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right. I think we utilize the space a little bit better now here too. We're going to leave a little bit more space open on... Maybe what we do is something like this. Like that. And then we... Um... Do something like this. So we have three tables on either end. And then a nice little walking space in between there. Hmm. Maybe we do something like this. Something like that, and then... Maybe something like that. And you've got kind of walking space all around. And a nice big area in here. I think that looks pretty good. Actually. Because then you like kind of... You walk in here. You get, you, you're you greeted by the cards right here in our cards. <laughs> and then you have the whole gaming area here. And then you walk through here. Which I kind of wish that we could just have as like a big like archway or something rather than a door. It's like it's not needed to be a door. And then you come in here, do your shopping. Check out. And then you can walk right out this door here. That would be really nice if they can, again, if they can do it that way. I don't know if that's the case, but I'm excited about that nonetheless. I really am. So yeah, we need to get shop level 20 to get an expansion for this right away, which I would like to do if we can. But uh, we will certainly see. 
Okay. Anyways, so let's go ahead and end off our day there. Yeah, see, so we had 76 customers, so two less than yesterday, but that's still quite a bit. I'm definitely A-OK -okay with that. I think we might get a few more gaming tables in here, too. Um, just honestly, like, maybe one or two more. I don't know. We'll see. I am going to readjust our pricing here real quick. Are people grabbing stuff from... Okay, something is weird with that. So we actually kind of need to have that open there, I guess. So they are not using this entrance. What? Okay, I'm so confused by that. But that's fine. I guess we'll uh, just do it that way for now. We'll just deal with the stink people. Yeah, we definitely need some more space in here. I don't know, did we screw this up with all of this? Can they just maybe not get through there or something? I guess that looks better like that anyways. You probably should do that. Okay, so there's people coming in here. It's just very odd. I don't know why... Like, are they not able to use this door here? Because now can people not buy individual cards? I'm so confused. Why are people not checking out also? Okay, I think something is bugged. Right now, I'm going to save, actually, because actually it's been a while since I've saved. Let's go to the main menu real quick, and then we're going to reload. Let's see what happens here with this, because I'm honestly not too sure. Something is odd with this right now. I guess we probably should have saved and reloaded before. Okay, people are at the checkout now. I know we, we've seen that before where we've had issues. Okay, so they are using the, this entrance now. Again, we're having an issue now with stinky people because we don't have... Our machines over here so I'm tempted to try and say let's swap this around again and see what happens with this because now that they're actually walking through here it should technically just be like one store it shouldn't be a separate thing I don't like how crammed this is too especially with this line at the moment <laughs> but I don't know we'll figure it out we'll uh we'll, we'll fix it one way or another I think it's actually kind of fits back here because we don't really need people to be able to see that back there. And then there's still walking space around for both of it. So I want to see, do they exit out of this door? I don't think they do. No, they do not exit out that door, which is fine. I mean, they can exit through there either way then. Let's get another, at least one play table here. I want to see... So if we were to do something like this, actually maybe what we do is we do two and two. So I might, once these guys are done here, I'm actually going to move them over to here, or that table over to here. Okay, people are still buying cards, so we are good with that. Nine dollars. I like it. I really do. I honestly think this looks really nice. Sir, you're not allowed to walk through that way. You have to walk through the through both of them. <laughs> you know what I think is happening is because now there's enough space for them to get around here. They can just use... Man, why are you just standing there? <laughs> okay. It's not as bad now. But, um... Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. I think I'm going to move this table over here so they can't just sneak on by here. I think is what needs to happen. Okay. So we're getting this figured out. Getting the new layout kind of 
figure it out with everything. It's going to take a little bit of trial and error to figure out what we want to do with it, but we'll get there for sure. Six dollars. Okay. Okay, there's still playing again. I'm just trying to move that over. I feel like it's going to be a little bit trickier to try to keep up with things now, though, at the same time. So I don't really like how this is separated. I'd prefer it to be together, but it's fine, too. It is what it is. I'm just going to order some of these real quick. I like having a second entrance, though, that's for sure. That is really nice. Um, So we got that to go back in there. Oh, these guys are done here. So yeah, I want to get this moved over so they can't just walk back through there, even though they can still walk right here, I guess, for that. Because I want them to walk through the whole the whole machine here. Our whole machined area. <laughs> With all of that, but it's fine. We'll figure it out. Okay. Yeah, they're not happy about it, but they're going to have to deal with it nonetheless. <laughs> okay. Anyways, we got to open up some more cards here, too. So we can keep these, keep the money flowing from that and the XP flowing from that. Okay. Yeah, I don't know, like I said, how I feel about this being separated like this. I kind of, I like a whole one shop. So I almost wish that we could just have the bigger shop itself. Oh, we got an empty box. Rather than doing it that way, but, I mean, it works. It does. That sale looks pretty good there. I like it. Got another stank person here. There we go. It's getting sprayed. Okay. Because, yeah, then people can still walk around back here from there. Um. Okay. Yeah, we need to get, again, some more cards opened up here so we can try to keep, keep the XP going because we still need another 1,200 XP, 1,250 or so for XP, so it's going to be a little bit here for that, so I want to make sure that we can try to get that here today, if we can. we got obviously a lot of work to go here. But we made some decent progress with this, so I like it. Okay. At least I guess we don't have to really worry so much about that shop over there. It's kind of just going to be itself, because it's... The only thing we need to worry about is just the cards over there. But the rest of that's just the game area, so we really don't even need to worry about that. Honestly, too much, so it can kind of just be its own separate entity. And then, except for, I guess, the, uh, the scent sprayers, too. We're gonna have to be mindful of that. But, oh, there we go. Nice little, I mean, that's like a $13 card, $14 card, something like that. So. Alright, um, let's see here. I'm really glad that we got the shop, though. We definitely need the space, so. I am happy to have it. It's just like it already feels like we're out of space, though, too. Because we're gonna have to make room for another new shelf. To go in, like, here or something. Which, actually, we probably could. We probably have the space for that, actually. Um, big warehouse. That's right. These are a thousand bucks a piece. Dang, I forgot how expensive these were. Oh, we don't have the space for it. Shoot. And I don't think that can... I mean, we do have this space here, but... I also think that might limit the, um... Can I move this, please? I want to... Okay, so that is about as close as we can get that where it was. Sir, you can go back and man the counter. I was going to say, did we just bug him? But no, we're good. All right. Um, so, yeah, we got our shelf, which is good. Definitely needed that. Okay, let's get our lights on here. And, um, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. I don't mind it. I mean, it's it's definitely not it's not ideal. I'd prefer again to have it all together. But at the same time, it's not terrible. I really don't hate it. Um, let's just start going through all of our items here. I guess what we need. Make sure that we stay stocked up here. I feel like again, it's a little trickier to keep things all stocked on up, but that's fine. We'll just keep on going here. Um, some greens. Yeah, we need a few of these along with some reds. Okay. 
Uh, some white dice right here. That's going to use up the rest of that box. Along with some black dice right, actually right there. We don't need any more. Got some figurines. And I feel like I'm all thrown off now in the location of all these. Oh, that's right. We're out of, what am I doing? Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Like I said, I'm not sure how I feel about this little kind of crammed room. Obviously, it's gonna we're going to expand it out. It's not going to stay this size, but it's going to take a little bit to get to that point. So that's where I'm like, maybe we just keep the game room in here or something and do it that way. But at the same time, it's nice to be able to grow into something else at the same time. So I don't know. We're also going through a lot of our stock of things here. So a lot of our money is going to have to go away here real soon to order stuff. But it's fine. We'll figure it out as we go. Okay. So there's all of that. We're all good with those. Let's get some of these out if we need any. Don't really too much. Need one of these and one of these right there. And there's like most of our stuff stocked up, which is awesome. Okay. Check up on our cards here. Make sure we're keeping up on these. Got to also check up on our um, our scent sprayer. Make sure that we're all good on all of that. Five bucks. Okay, we're good for now. Hey, look at this. We're doing really good here with all of that. We really are. I'm honestly really happy with that. Um, blue dice and these guys we could use some of. So figurines, some of the little bats. We need to get some more of these in too. That's something we need to spend some money on here soon, but again, we are so close to getting our um, our next uh, no, next shop level, so we can get our new cards in, which I'm really stoked for. I'm really excited, and I want to get those in ASAP. Okay, got a little bats there. Let's see here again. Let's. I feel so crammed in here, though. I don't like it. it feels kind of claustrophobic. With this, I feel like I'm getting a little almost motion sickness, dizzy, like spinning around and stuff. And I know I get that, I get comments from you guys a lot saying that um, for us to move slower, like rotate around slower because you guys get motion sickness, which I do understand. So I do apologize. I try to keep that in mind um, with that, but um, sometimes it's not always easy when I'm trying to do so much too at the same time. Okay. Let's see here. Okay. There we go. Oh, there we go. That's a decent card. Nothing like too crazy. But it's not like a our thousand dollar card right there. But hey, it's it's something. Okay. I want to see where we're at too for our progress of unlocking the next event type here. Also, come on, something something good here. Something good. Another ghost card or something. Um. Look at all the people we have in your plan. That is just insane. It really is. Okay. Yeah, we've got to be getting close to our next event here, don't we? 1314. So we're, I mean, 186 away. So we'll be another, we'll be 175 or so away, roughly, when um, we're all said and done. Okay. Yeah, we just need to get a couple more of the scent sprayers in here. That's going to be helpful for us because then we can open up this side so they can use both sides. But obviously, we need to get a um, shop expansion too before we do that. But you know, what? let's um, while we wait for everyone to kind of funnel on out of here, let's get some. Let's rip through another set of card packs so we can level up also because we are so close. And then we can get the new cards in here tonight, and then we can actually start opening some up here tomorrow, right away. In game time, today's it. We'll be doing that here today in in today's episode, but. <laughs> in-game, uh, tonight. Okay. There we go. I mean, there's a few dollar one there. Nothing, again, too crazy, but hey, it's all progress. Okay. It's all right. It is what it is. There we go. There's shop level 20. That unlocks a new size for us in here, which we really need desperately because it is so tiny. And then the new cards here, finally. So that is awesome. And then shop level 21, we unlock another one for the other shop over there. Oh, there we go. There's a $53 card. Let's go, baby. Okay. 
That is huge right there. Let's let's get it out right away. High dollar cards. It's a sixty-four dollar card right there. That is insane. Okay, so let's get our uh, new items in here. Our first legendary card pack, which again I would love to get these, but it's me shop level twenty-six, so that's going to be a while a ways before we can do that. So I'm not too worried about it. Let's just order double of them right away, and then uh, we should be good to go with all of that. So there we go. Let's go ahead and get our brand new cards in here. Let's get them priced on out right away before somebody comes in here and grabs all of them. That's a $10 card pack there. That is insane. Now we're going to have to remember to be ordering doubles of these when we do, though, because then we got to basically order like it would be two. Okay. And then didn't we make... Actually, you know what? Let's let's move these guys over to here then. For that, because these are gonna take over for here. And then the other um, card sleeves. Honestly, I think this is this is just gonna be like our accessories out over here or something. Like this. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get these rotated here. There we go. Okay, um, yeah, I think that should be good. Let's go ahead and we are going to end off the day there. So we get another day going. Only 61 people in here today. I feel like we kind of got a little messed up with having to reload and everything and all that. So it is what it is. We're moving on to day 43. Let's go ahead and open up. Let's make sure, yep, main entrance, good. That looks awesome. Um, let's just get our, some of our pricing adjusted here. Okay. We do need to get some things ordered on in here, but we are very broke at the moment now. After ordering all of those packs and everything. But that's fine. It is what it is. Okay. It's amazing how we keep bumping up on price on all of these. I'm so excited. We, we're about to open up our first legendary pack, though. That is so exciting. It's been a long time coming to get to that. Now we've got, like, our... Of the uh, Tetramon series cards, that is all of them. At least, uh, minus the big pack. Which, that's next shop level. I think shop level 21 is when we unlock the small pack of those. So we're certainly going to look into that for sure, too, when we can. But we also need to get our new, our new uh, shop size. Whoops. There we go. Yeah, we need to get our new shop size here too. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Um, 300 bucks. Right there. Look at that. It gets us another window too. I think we're going to actually move this guy back. Sir, can you please speed up? Ah, dang it. Or maybe we use that for a storage area. I don't know. Yeah, maybe we use this for storage here instead. There we go. I think it looks better. Let's use that for a little bit of storage. And we'll kind of continue to move our storage racks back that way then when we can. So we got our new um, shop area. So again, 25 is the next one for that. Uh, 21 is for the next one in the main area, and then we've got our um, legendaries at, oh, 23 is what we need for that. So that's going to be a little bit, but let's go ahead and open up our first legendary packs. Let's see what we got. Something good here. Come on. Finger, both fingers crossed here. There we go. There's a $21 card to start things out. It's not too bad. We're obviously going to have a lot of new cards to start out here, but that is what this is all about. Okay. There's a $14 card. Let's go, baby. I feel like it's something pretty decent every time. Look at that. A $30 pack right there. Oh, it's exciting. There's a $17 card. $8.50. Okay. It's kind of fun. We get to go through and like slow roll it again here. With all these new cards that we're getting. Oh, <laughs> let's go. That's like a $400 card right there with the 20% markup. That is insane. Let's go, baby. 
That's what these legendary cards are about. That is insane. I'm so stoked and excited for this. Okay. I was gonna look to see how much these cost us, the market price of these, because I want to see where what we need to get to to break even on these and where we need to be at. Okay. I think this might be the last one here. But hey, at least we got a decent we got a really good pull out of that. A few hundred like a four hundred dollar card. Oh, we got one more here, I think. Thought that was our last one, but I guess not. There we go. Okay. Hey, there we go. Yep, that was it. Okay, where do we need to be at? So 841, about 850 or so is where we need to be to break even on those. Let's go ahead and get this bad boy placed on down. Yeah, 402 with that is where that's going to land. That is insane. $25. I'm glad we left this kind of empty. Not empty, but empty enough where we, we have space to put down our new cards in here then. $17. Okay. Look at all of this. We got some brand new cards. Go on out here. All right. There we go. Look at that. All right. Let's see where our shelving is at here, too, for all of this. We need a couple more of those boxes here, which these boxes are now back here. Yeah, it's going to be really tricky to try to remember where everything goes here with all of this. Um... Anything else here? We need a couple of these figurines out here. Uh, all right. So I know we need to get the other card sleeves out, along with our on oh no, our sprays out there already. Okay, that's good. Um, where are we at then? Also for was it shop level twenty two is what we need for this next um next battle deck? I guess is the name of it. And then we're breaking into the um. Is that Duel? I don't know. Those are all Duel Master. Okay, I don't know what... Um... Oh, Destiny. Or those are Destiny 2. Okay, yeah, I guess the Destiny ones are a different setup of those. So, anyways, um, let's see here. We need another... Honestly, we could have we could have put this over there in the back in the corner, but I kind of prefer because this could actually go up against the wall, and it looks kind of normal, where those have to be stuck out further, so it doesn't look as good. So I think I'd rather actually keep those. Oh, I forgot to be checking our sprayers too. Got to make sure we're keeping up. Yeah, we need one, just one. Okay, it's not too bad. Let's just grab one off the shelf real quick. Get it added into there. We got a thousand bucks so to play with, so I like it. We definitely need to order some stock of things here, too. We've got, oh, a lot in bills. Ugh. Okay. Well, there is almost all of our bills paid. I'd rather, let's just get caught up on our bills here, too. And then we'll order some stock of things, what we can, here in just a bit. These last two episodes, though, we made some amazing progress. And I'm super proud of the store and so happy with where it's at. I really am. All right. Let's get this in. Let's get all of these. Just build on up as much as we can. Okay. That's already repriced. So that is good. Okay. Yeah, I think we need to get like some posters up and stuff on the walls here too. That would be really nice. But we obviously, we've just been so focused on everything else going on right here right now. It's been a little tricky to try to... Focus on spending money on something else. Um, let's get some of these. Just trying to restock up things here because we've been really lacking on stock of things here now. But it's all a part of it. Just have a bunch of stuff to go through and do. Those are already all stocked up. We need some of these. I don't like having the small boxes. I honestly like having the bigger boxes of things. I really do. They look better on the shelves too. And nope, good on those. Need a few of these. Yeah, we are. I'm acting. I'm thinking like we have so much money, but we are actually really broke at the moment. I'm like, oh, we got to order this, we got to order that, and we got all this stuff to order, and we are just too broke to even do any of it. But it is what it is. We're just going to stay in our lane and keep doing our thing here. Nope, we're all good on these. Got some of these. Okay. Uh, 
Um, yeah, we need a couple of those also at the same time. We're out of both of those. So that is everything that we have currently. So we are just out of everything else at the moment. Yeah, we got to get some lights on here too. Getting a little dark. Okay, that's already priced on out. We got one more slot right here for this card to go in. Another $5 card. Okay. We definitely will be at opening up this entrance here, but I just need to get some sprayers in here first before we do that. So I really, we really need to work on that um, here first. That's right, that's got the little bump out there. I was going to say we could... What if we were to do this, like this, and then this can go right here, like that. There we go. I think it looks way better. Gives It opens this up more. It's not so crammed in here then. I think it looks a lot nicer. Okay. Yeah, I'd say that looks way better. And we could actually even move him over to here at that point then, too. Okay. Yeah, look, I mean, look at all the stuff that we need to order here. Ugh. Plus, we need to order these here, too, and remove them from over here. Actually, we already adjusted. It's just that. That's still existing. But yeah, we need to add a space right there, then. So let's actually get those in here, if we can. We also have these, too. Could we... Hmm... Trying to see what we have the space for at the moment to be able to do something else with those. We just need another shelf, and here's what we need. I don't know. Let's not worry about ordering something else in here. Let's just get. Let's just stay in our lane here. Let's focus on what we need to. Okay. Yeah, that can go like that. Now we got something else in here at least, and all of our bills are caught up and paid though too, so that's really good. Uh, whoops. Let's get... I don't remember which one it is. It's fine. Just leave it alone. Okay, we got a few more of these to go on out. There we go. Alright, we still got some people in here. It's fine. How are our shelves doing? Not great. Not terrible, but not great either. <laughs> oh, geez. Okay. Yeah, we definitely need to get some things ordered up here. But uh, it's not awful. Definitely could be worse. Okay. Mm, anything else? Everything else is looking pretty good. We still got our ghost card there. Nobody's taking it. <laughs> okay. Um... Green, we don't need any of, so that's all good. We Do we need any black dice? We actually do. Let's grab one of them. Okay. Blue dice? Nope, we're all good on these. Yeah, it definitely doesn't feel as crammed in here now with having these moved around, at the very least. So that's good anyway. Um, We're all good on those. Yeah, we need a few of these. Okay. Nope, we're all good on these. And then, yeah, we need some more of these. Whoops. Okay. So, yeah, we need a bunch of stuff. That's what we need. We need those. Oh, that's where they're, they're at. Okay, I knew that they were somewhere. I just wasn't sure where. But, yeah, so we've got... Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, it's it's a lot that we need to get caught up on here. But it's fine. It is what it is. We actually we really need some other some card packs here. So I'd say let's get like two of those. We need some of the pink the epic um cards there. 
We don't need either of those, but we need the blues. We need one of these and one of these. So that gets all of those. We need some snag spray, actually. Some cleaner. And... Anything else we, like, really desperately need? Could you... Yellow die or yellow deck. Yeah, we could use a yellow deck one as well as a blue if we can afford it. Yeah, I think we should be okay. I didn't even realize we just skipped this sleeve here completely because it went right. <laughs> okay, I didn't even realize that we just skipped that. Hmm. Yeah, no, there's a lot that we need. Really, guys, you could be playing together. Pick you up. Get you on out of here. Okay. He's doing, yep, he's, or actually both of them are doing some shopping. I'm okay with that. Um, let's see here. So we already added, or did we, did I not add? No, I didn't even add the deck boxes. So, because, yeah, I got distracted with the other stuff. <laughs> so, yellow and blue, which brings us up to that, which we actually need here. And then, white and the red. White and the red brings us up to 1866. Hmm. Honestly, that's about everything that we really actually need. Pretty close. Let's get these this stuff stocked on up. That's actually, like I said, almost what we need. Very close, but... Yeah, let's get our spray. Which, again, this is going to go on, like, the accessories kind of shelf right there. And then let's get our yellow deck boxes here. And this is a very long episode for only three days here. So we spent a lot of time reorganizing the store here with all of this. But that's alright. I know you guys don't seem to mind, especially on these longer videos. So I hope you guys are enjoying this and you're sticking around. For this, I really appreciate it if you guys are. Okay. We got some dice here. I would really like to get all these shelves together, but obviously we got... We don't... Space doesn't allow us to or allow us to. Even though I guess we could, we could honestly stick the register back there and then have all the shelves right here too at the same time. So I don't know. We'll see. We might rearrange this a little bit and see where things go with everything. But we'll see where we're at with all the stuff here and see what needs to be re uh, reordered and stocked up here. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, it leaves us with $260. So it's not a ton of money, but it's something. And this is just the um, these packs. It's again why I don't like having the small boxes of stuff. I like just getting the double, the big ones right away. But it's fine. Okay. So, um, where does that leave us? All the figurines, basically, except for those. Those deck boxes. And that's, that's that. Our shelves aren't looking too bad, though, so we'll take that. Um, yeah, I mean, that's... A pretty good darn day right there. We had 79 customers. That is our new highest total right there. 1388. So we made about about a thousand bucks. We basically make about a thousand every day on our um event there. Which speaking of that, 1370. So next episode we should be getting our new event, which is awesome. But I think that is going to be a good point to um to wrap up this episode here, guys. I think we're gonna we're gonna come back in the next one. Trying to get a nice um, overview of these stores, but there's really no good way to um, to get them here. <laughs> but, okay. I think that's going to be, like I said, a good point to wrap up this episode here, guys. So we're going to come back in the next one. We're going to keep working on expanding, I guess, all of our operations here. We got some great progress done here. We got our second store unlocked. We got the legendary cards unlocked. We need to get our supply of stock of things bumped up a little bit more. And um, just keep on working on everything else here. Try to expand and unlock more new products. 
with this. So if you guys have any suggestions, be sure to leave them in the comments down below. Let me know what you guys think. But if you guys did enjoy this, be sure to drop a like in the video, show it some love and support. And if you guys are new around here, checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we are doing here. But thank you all very much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you on the next one. Peace out, guys. Thank you.